Oh, it's really difficult to say because there are so many good sprinters right now, but uh, I would say it's Caleb Ewan and Sam Bennett. It depends on the, of the horn straight, if it's a long one or a short one. I use between 53 and 55, 11. And yeah, it depends if it's uphill, downhill, or how the, how the horn straight is. We change all the, for every race, we change the gears. Straight after the race, we, we get the recovery shake and also some uh, proteins. And then we take a, a short or little little lunch, like rice or pasta. And then we come home for massage in the hotel. And then afterwards, we have a big dinner and then we go to bed early. Like it depends of how long the transfer is and all the things. Sometimes we are on bed, in bed already at eight o'clock. Sometimes it takes like 10 o'clock or later on it's always different uh, it's really difficult to say because there are so many good sprinters right now but uh, i would say it's caleb ewan and sam bennett because for sure they are one of the best sprinters in the world right now and yeah but there are so many other riders to add like Wegen, jakobsen and yeah you could say a list of 10 15 riders and they never would end <laughs> uh, my first race i did with six years because my all my family were cyclists too, like in amateur cycling. And yeah, and then I just had no other possibility and yeah, I just started cycling. Right. <laughs> but the first time on my bike, I think it was with two and a half years. Uh, winter, we do uh, a lot of gym training. And yeah, I do some squats and some other things. But yeah, in the summertime, we have not that many time or that much time for some weight liftings. Because yeah, we have also some, or we need some time from recovering, or for recovering from the race, and yeah, and then it's not so easy to do it all year long. I think it's uh, Eschborn Frankfurt because it's the only stray who is less or in around one hour from my hometown, <laughs> so it's a bit like my home race. And yeah, I won it two years ago, and for me it was really special because I did it already when I was really young. And I think I won it already five times in total, with also in under 11, under 13, under 15. And yeah, I think that's my special and favorite race. Because when I was young, I was all the time cheering for, for Team Telecom. And so I think it would be him. <laughs> I think it was around 1,950. But yeah, it's a long time ago and I cannot say if it's the right number or not. I think it was a Vicini and it was pink. <laughs> but unluckily we, we sold it when I was young and so now I don't know where it is. But yeah, it would be great to get it back. But I don't know how, how it's a good way to get it back because it's already uh, 18 years ago that we sold it and I think it's somewhere not to find anymore. <laughs> but if I see it, I can say straight it's mine or not. <laughs> For sure my dream would be the Tour de France, but it's not sure right now if I, if, if I participate. But if it's the Tour or if I'm on the start list, then it's definitely the Tour de France this year. But for now on, it's uh, Mailand San Remo. And yeah, because it was also a big dream for me to stay on the start line. And this year I will be. And yeah, for now it's uh, Milan San Remo. <laughs> Maybe it's the Tour de France, but right now it's uh, definitely the Giro d'Italia. And yeah, the world there was also nice, but it was not so good for a sprinter because there are so many mountain stages. But right now it's the Giro d'Italia. I think it was around 120. And it was in a tour of Guangxi 2018. I was former in the Bartnett Rose team. It was a, like a farm team of the German national team. And I was first a track rider and then I got a knee injury and I lost the contact to the best riders on the track. So I decided, okay, let's try something else. And then I was focusing more on the road. And yeah, finally I was lucky and it worked out <laughs> and now it's it's still my dream to be a pro cyclist and i'm really happy that i had this knee injury to have to had to change something the most important is the helmet because it saved my life many times already 
And for me, by self, it's the, the glasses because I cannot ride without glasses because when I get the wind in my eyes, eyes I cannot see anything. Or if it's raining, I, I cannot see anything. So for me, it's the glasses. Sometimes it's, it sounds bad, but it's uh, mostly like less training because you have to be really fresh as a sprinter. And that means like less training and more recovery time. <laughs>